What is up, everybody? It is JD Temple here from the Light of the Darkness. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. And please subscribe if you would, because it helps the channel and the algorithm and all that a lot. Give the video a like too, or a dislike. Either one of those are helpful as well. Um, I mean, of course, I do want to grow the channel, and I do appreciate it. I appreciate all the channel members, all of our soul family. Um, I will have the Oracle card readings coming out for the soul family members um, here this week at some point. And there will be a special ritual that will be for all channel members this month, too, in the month of December. I haven't quite figured out what exactly it's going to be yet, um, you know. For all of you that I didn't get to say Happy Thanksgiving to, Happy Thanksgiving, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa, um, Merry Christmas to all of you that uh, I may not see until then, and people may be taking off and going on trips and doing all that kind of stuff. So 2023 was really difficult. 2023 was a hell of a year. 2023 was a lot of things energetically and spiritually and physically just smashed into a great big ball of craziness and kind of catapulted throughout the universe and we've all been feeling it we've all um you know had our trials and tribulations from all of the crazy alignments and conjunctions and you know thing trines and squares and all of that crazy stuff astrologically speaking uh, 2023, it was nuts. Um, I did have some good moments, don't get me wrong, but 2023, for the most part, was very, very, it was extremely difficult. Um, this year for Christmas and for New Year's, I'm going to find myself, um, spending some time alone, and that's okay. That's, that's how that goes sometimes. Um, I will be uh, seeing my daughters on Christmas Eve and Christmas morning. That'll be great. But um, Christmas night and New Year's, I'm going to be alone. And I figure there's just no better thing to do than to do some magic. Um, Azazel and Lucifer both came to me on this too. And um, they formulated two amazing rites. These are going to be group rituals. And um, I'll be performing them um, along, you know, with your energy. And I really do love each and every one of you that participates in these group rituals that we do. Um, you know, like I've had so many positive emails, so much positive feedback, so many people that participate in each and every single one that I do. And I can't thank you enough. And uh, this is all something, this is an endeavor that we're working on together, changing our lives and evolving um, together, you know, as a group, as a family, as a, a spiritual entity in and of itself almost. Um, and so for the one that's going to take place on Christmas night, this one's going to be featuring a Zazel. And this ritual is actually called um, the Illumination of the Scapegoat. It's a two-part ritual, and you can choose either to participate in the whole thing or just one part of it, depending on what you want to do. It's all up to you. Uh, the first phase, which is going to be on Christmas night, um, that's the scapegoat portion. That's what I'm going to be calling forth a Zazel and doing a cord cutting with all of the energies, all of the people, places, things, and situations that no longer serve you particularly from 2023 things that you do not want to carry over in 2024 all of that stuff can be washed away all those cords can be cut any of those energies any of that confusion um, anything coming off of a lot of those uh, crazy Mercury retro retrogrades where there was confusion created, misunderstandings perhaps, things that you really want to get rectified in 2024 but that you really just need to cut loose of and leave behind in 2023. That's what this first portion of the ritual is going to be. Um, and then the illumination portion, and that's when Lucifer is going to come into play, and that's going to be on New Year's. Uh, New Year's Eve at midnight. So as the ball is dropping, I'm going to be calling forth Lucifer 
for myself and on your behalf to just illuminate your path in 2024 to help you to fully integrate all of those powers and energies of the age of Aquarius into your life and to kind of like leave the dust behind the old dirt and the grime and the confusion and the anything that caused you any grief or chaos in 2023 to cut that loose to, to leave it behind and then to forge a new path for 2024 with Lucifer walking by your side with Azazel walking by your side illuminating the path really um, illuminating everything that's hiding in those shadows so that you can continue to focus on those things that are holding you back so that you can light your own way illuminating the path for 2024 so important for success and that is what i'm inviting all of you all to join me in this venture um, again you can decide to be take part in just a the por a portion of it whether you want the azazel cord cord cutting portion or if you want the um the illumination of Lucifer, which is it's a prosperity right, basically as well. It's it's a road opener and prosperity right that will involve the energy of Lucifer and giving all blood offerings to Lucifer and Azazel for prosperity for 2024, taking place on New Year's Eve on New Year's Day. So it's the perfect timing. Um, these two things together, it's very it's it's a perfect thing to do to go ahead and to remove the old, to usher in the new. It's New Year's, it's Christmas, it's the end of the year, the end of 2023, ushering in 2024, it's the perfect time, it's the perfect place. So I hope that you all will join me on Christmas, on New Year's, both of those or one or the other. Um, my Cash App and PayPal details will be in the description of the video, um, as always. Um, everyone will receive uh, ritual video footage as well as any incantations and anything that they will need to um, to really fully um, connect with the energy of these rites. All that will be emailed to you so you receive all those things as usual. Um, I love you all. I hope you're all doing well out there. Um, I'm doing good. I've just been plugging along. I've been really, really busy. Um, as the end of the year is ending here, I've been like really picking up on ritual work and it's been kind of crazy, but I'm doing the best I can to keep up with it all and to serve everybody as needed. Um, so yeah, that's where I'm at, but I hope all of you are doing good. Um, I really do. I know it's, it's been a challenge. It's been a challenge. Um, you know, I'm not going to say life is perfect, but it is what you make it. And we're here. You're here. You have to do the very best that you can do to stay optimistic, to stay happy, to not let anxiety rule the day, to not let negativity rule the day. You can do it. You're worth it. I'm worth it. We're all worth it. I love you all. Smell my face. Smell it good. See you soon. Peace.